Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Today is Saturday, September 8, 2012. I'm speaking with Mr. Kumud Ranjan Rai. Uh, this interview is being conducted in New Jersey. Mr. Rai, what's your dish? I was born in village Dirgha, district Borishal, Bengal, okay. India, that is part before partition of India. Before. Uh, uh, at that time, it was India. India, of course. Uh, Borishal, what's the name of the village again? Dirga. Dirga. How far was it from Borishal city? Do you have any idea? I think it's about 25, 30 miles west. So west? West of the city, yes. West of the city. Yeah, towards, uh, towards Khulna. Towards Khulna. Okay. Have you ever gone to the uh, to uh, Borishal city? Oh, yeah. I, I, I actually graduated from... Borishal Jilai School. Oh, I see. Yeah. That's very nice. I've been there. Mm. Uh, so how did you used to go there? Uh, from your village, Digha to... Oh, no, I used to live there. No, but but when on, on during vacation, during puja and holidays, oh, you used to come we, and we go? take by steamer. Steamer? steamer. How long it, it used to take? I think it would take about um, six hours, five, six, six hours. Five, six hours. Yes. Um, that now, steamer used to go from Kulna to Borishal. Okay, and then, then used to drop at the... That was the stop. Stop at, what's the name of the river port? Okay, um, uh, there, there was a station called... Uh, I don't remember the name, but okay. there is a, a okay. station also Dirga. Later on, Dirga, okay. Dirga was a station. Okay. So. okay, so how was it a... Dirga was a small place? This is a village, yes. Village, how, how large or how small was it? I think it should be about a mile long. Okay. Yeah. And maybe three quarters. And, and, uh, and what was it? A um, uh, mixed village or Hindu village? or? It was Hindu village. Hindu village? There is no Muslim. So, did you, did you do, was there any school there? Did you there was to? a high school, yes. Uh, even there, Dirga? Dirga but high school. You went to Borishal Jela High School? In fact, yes. I uh, In that high school, I went up to grade 8. Okay. Then, I grade 9, I went to Piyaspur Government High School. Okay. And then, um, I, uh, 10th grade, I went to oh. Borishal Jela High School. Okay, so you moved, you, you know three places, Piyaspur yes. too? Yes. Um, <laughs> how was your house like? Was it a big house, small house, hut? Uh, do you have any uh, idea? Uh, our house? Yes, our house. Uh, yeah. It was a uh, quite good house. Good, good house. Good, not a hot. Okay. But not a very big one, but okay. it is. How many? It is two story house. Two story? Yes. In that place? Yes. How many uh, generations they lived, you, you know, you think? Uh, five generations. Five generations, that's a yes. long time. Yes, yes. And uh, do you have any idea where before that you were to move for another place of Borishal or something? No, that I don't know. Who else lived with you in the village? Uh, my father. Mother, okay. cousins. Cousins. Uh, so it was in, by our term, it was an extended family. Extended Uncles family. Uncles and uh, aunts. Yes, you know, five generations there. Five generations were living in the same place. Uh, but some of them moved some other yeah, yeah, places. But basically, but otherwise, it was a household for that law. Yes. Now, <clears throat> what was the name of your parents? My father's name was Gangadhar Rai. Okay. And my mother's name was Kadombini Rai. Okay. And did they uh, work uh, outside? Uh, what was the profession? Uh, my father was a school teacher and also village postmaster. Oh, he very had, nice. he had both two oh, jobs. <laughs> <laughs> and I suppose your mother was a housewife. Mother was okay. a housewife. That's uh, right. How many brothers and sisters? I have three sisters. Okay. And I am the only. Okay, but son. I'm the only son. So, so they all gave all the love to you. No, <laughs> very good love, brothers and sisters. Now, can you tell us how? your house look like? A little bit of description of the house, uh, description of the village. Mostly the house are, all the sides are tin, mm -hmm. it's mm -hmm. called tin mm -hmm. and... But you said two-story house in your case? Y yes. yes, but and our, but our, our my, my house was, mm -hmm. top was tile, mm -hmm. not tin. Oh, so... Tile so because my father was sensitive to heat yeah, and yeah, he yeah. found out that if this tile it gives less heat. Yeah, of course. Of and course. that's that's all all other houses in so in, in, in my ha, in, in neighborhood. In the neighborhood. Uh, actually our ha, our house is a cluster of parents, uh, yeah, our yeah, yeah. cousins and, and uh, we have seven houses in okay. uh, around and there is a big anybody big, 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 anybody still living there? Yes. <coughs> some of some of the distant cousins are still distant there. cousins are still there. Yes. Have you been to Dinga? Uh, later on? Uh, 
Uh, no, after, after I, uh, last time I had been in 1955. 55. So, what, when did you migrate to India? 55. 55. After, after graduation from so, high school. For quite some time, so you, you were there after partition? Yes. So, <clears throat> why did you come? Why? That's a good question. Why did I come? Because it was not mainly because, though there was a tension because it became Pakistan and everybody was frightened all the time. There all the time. Was Muslims there any incidents? Do you, do you recall? Were there any incidents in your village? Yes, there there was there was uh, there was an incident. Not exactly our village. In a neighboring village, one lady was kidnapped. Kidnapped. Kidnapped by and? some Muslims. A Hindu lady was kidnapped Hindu lady by, was kidnapped by kidnapped Muslims. Muslims. Yeah. Oh. Uh, did and you know what happened? I was too really young. Uh, Even uh, parents wouldn't talk. Probably. No, because after that incident, mm -hmm. the the police officers came to our, our house. Our house is a big. In yeah. the in the in the village, ours was the biggest. Okay. House. Mm -hmm. And um, they had a meeting. They. They Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, they had a meeting in our, in yeah, our house. Yeah. The police officer came yeah. to pacify us that don't be frightened, okay. we'll take care. And that, that meeting was held in our house. In, house. in, in our house, yeah. So in, in the foreground of our house. So, so who to, what can you tell us, the, the type of the migration, who came, who came, uh, your parents came? Okay, the problem, yeah, my, uh, my parents, because we didn't have any income, though after partition, my parents were eager to move, mm -hmm. get out of that country, mm -hmm. because we know it all is intention. Yeah. So, but uh, we had no income, so we did not take chance that we we'll go to some camp, and so we did not mm -hmm. take that. Yeah. But um, my youngest, uh, my sister, mm -hmm. I mean, uh, of the three sisters, my youngest one has just told that to me. Okay. So she went to college, and she... She went to which college she went She is to Scottish Church College. Oh, in Calcutta. Calcutta. Okay. And then after um, after um, she completed her IA, mm -hmm. and they, we had a Gurudev, and we asked my parents, asked Gurudev, what, what she should do now? Mm -hmm. He said that you need some income, so most, most probably she would go to study nursing. Okay. Because nursing is easier to get a job. Okay. So she uh, went for studying nursing, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and uh, she went to the presidency um, hospital, it was SSKM hospital. Yeah. Now. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and and that was the highest uh, type of yeah. nursing education at that time. I see. And she went there for three years. Mm -hmm. She graduated from there. Mm -hmm. She got a job, and then we moved. Oh, so it was her income. It was her income. <laughs> she was the anchor. She was the she anchor. Was, then she was barely actually, a teenager. Actually, actually, she never got married. Oh. So she took the responsibility of the she whole house. She took the responsibility of the house. Yeah, that was that was I have heard that was that story of many many families. Yeah. But one boy or, or a girl, mm -hmm. they they took the shelter. Now, so do you remember how was the what kind of a situation did your parents and rest of the family moved? How was the decision like? How was the where did they go next? Okay. Uh, I, in fact, when I I. Graduated from the school, mm -hmm. I was ready to go to college. My sister was still; she is also still going to the college. Okay. So, but luckily, I got a um, some admission in the Ramkrishna Mission in Pathuria Ghatta. Have you heard the name? Pathuria Ghatta is the name. Mission, which is now in Narendrapur. Oh, I that see. was in Pathuria Ghatta before. Oh, I see. So, where is Pathuria Pathuria Ghatta? It, it is in. Um, Vivekananda Road and Jadulal Mallik Road. Oh, you know, Jadulal Mallik Road near, very close to okay, Nimtala okay. Ghat. Yeah, yeah. If okay. you take the in Vivekananda Road, yes. Within Calcutta, yeah. Within okay. Calcutta. Yeah. So you went to school then? And I got an admission in Presidency College. Okay. So I used to stay in the um, Ramkrishna Mission mm -hmm. and I used to come, come to Presidency College. Come okay. to the Presidency College. Yeah. So at that time, though you were, you were technically a Pakistani, but came to India for college admission, those problems were not there in '55. Uh, th 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 that was not the problem because okay. oh, I, I did one thing also. Up, just after partition, I came to India mm. and I got an Indian passport. Okay. And I uh, stayed in Pakistan with Indian passport. Okay. So, but nobody would know. So, you you had you had you had done that. Now, mm. so how did your parents come? 
Okay, then after my sister got a job, okay. then they came. Then they came? Then they came. Uh, they came by boat? Did they bring any, oh, any furniture? That, that, that's the one thing. In fact, no, we did not bring any furniture. Mm -hmm. But we had still that steamer connection. Okay. But once I remember, I had to come to board because um, we, we traveled several times too, okay. because my maternal uncle was a doctor in Calcutta. Okay. So we used to visit time to time. Okay. And um, sometimes we came by boat also. It okay. would take about two, three days okay. from Dirga to Khulna. Okay. And from Khulna we will take the train. Train. So that's what your parents also did? My, no, my parents they, they took the steamer. Steamer. That steamer that goes from Borishal to Khulna. Okay. So they took the steamer from Dirga station, mm -hmm. came to Khulna, mm -hmm. and from Khulna they came to... Uh, uh, and they, they, so when they came, did they bring any asset or anything no, with them? nothing, nothing. Uh, what, and they, br uh, they, they brought their... Uh, the, you're not with them, but then I suppose... They, what about their brothers and sisters? Younger brothers or other brothers and sisters? Or other sisters? Oh, my other sister. Yes. Oh, they they got married before. Oh, before. They, they got married. They, they got married in Calcutta, in West Bengal, no, no. or in Bangladesh. In in uh, in in, in, in Bangladesh. In, in Bangladesh. Yes. Okay. Uh, so so they were the only two. Your your parents came to to Kolkata. Yes. Now, do you, did they tell you what was the their feeling when they're leaving their ancestral home of five generations? Oh, uh, uh, yeah. It was. It was. Very difficult for them. It was not easy, but uh, circumstances. It has been two circumstances because we yeah. found out that it is very life would be very difficult to live over there. Yeah. Um, so, uh, <coughs> so when you came to, um, so the building was given to somebody else to live. Building was left, and most probably we don't know. Yeah. Most probably our cousins and somebody. Okay, somebody started living. Family. Yes. Okay. We left all our property also, we had a lot of landed property, so we left everything. So just you became penniless, depending on a young lady's yes. income. We, we did not sell any, any property because nobody used, used to buy and if, we did not want to sell it to the yeah. Muslims, really speaking. Okay. Muslims would be willing to buy, but we did not want to interfere that our cousins has land yeah. around and yeah. our land is in okay. between the land is taken by Muslims. Mm -hmm. We did not want to yeah. want that, so we did not sell our land. Okay. So, <coughs> when you came to India, was there any other help from government or anything? No, but you do, you we did not, not take any help. From but you didn't even declare yourself refugee because you, you already took a passport and you're, yes. you're dependent on your yes. sisters. No, we you did not take any help from government. Okay. Though uh, we had to go through some difficult yeah. times. Have you ever thought that Hindus are minority in Bangladesh, Muslims are majority. In West Bengal, Muslims are minority, Hindus are majority. Why in West Bengal, Muslims are able to stay, and in Bangladesh, Hindus have not been able to stay? Yeah, that's very, very bad thing. Why? I don't know. Well, Muslims are, I, I believe, it might be something political, or Muslims are not as good-hearted as Hindus. We, And they, they are they are even enjoying more freedom than Hindus, I believe. Really? Okay. <laughs> I believe. Okay. But uh, but in, in uh, but Bangladesh. Could could Hindus have lived by force? That means if, if they say we are not going to live, we want to we are not going to go to India. Was it possible for Hindus to take a stand? No, no, we'll fight out. Uh, no, because uh, really, uh, I, I don't think so. It, it was very difficult for them yeah. for, to fight with the Muslims. Yes. Yeah. Now, <coughs> do you know if anybody... Now, you went to... So, after Ramakrishna Mission, uh, you stayed, you went to Presidency College, and after Presidency College... I went to B.E. College. Bengal Engineering College. Bengal Engineering and you'd be engineering there. Yes. And then you came to the United States. Um, uh, which year you came here? I, 1972. 72, way, way back. Um, have you ever thought, um, have you ever gone back to visit Dirga? After I, I, I did not go to Dirga, but I once went to Borishal. Borishal. Because right, my, my brother-in-law, in fact, I Borishal, when I went to Borishal Village School, I stayed with my brother-in-law. Okay. My eldest sister's uh, husband, husband. with that family. Yeah. 
And so I went to ask to visit them in Borisal. So they are still living in Borisal? No, they ultimately moved to India. India too. Um, have you ever thought, um, has anybody benefited because of the division of Bengal? Oh, the, not, not Hindus. Muslims have been benefited, I believe. Okay. Hindus really, they are not, still little, little now I hear it a little bit better. I mean better than before, but at the beginning they had difficult time. No okay. jobs and nothing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, what when people ask you where you're from, what you what is your desh, what do you say? I say India. India. Because the, the, India was not divided at that yeah, time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, do you think Hindus and Muslims can live together? It's very difficult, very difficult because Muslims are not as generous as Hindus. Okay. We entertain all religion to grow, mm -hmm. but. If you see the history of the world, mm -hmm. Muslims country, very other religions, mm -hmm. very difficult to survive, mm -hmm. I believe. That's what okay. I see. Okay. Uh, I'm almost to the end. Um, is there anything else? No, before I ask that question. In India, so in Kolkata, so finally, where did they settle? Where did they, they call home? What, in Kolkata, your family, where did they settle finally? Uh, in Kolkata. Kolkata. What part of Kolkata? Uh, uh, no, no, North Kolkata. North Kolkata. Okay. And they're still. Uh, some of them are still living there. Uh, nobody. Yeah. Then oh, they, yeah. they have gone. I sold the house. They sold the house. Okay. Uh, now the last question: um, Is there anything else you want to add that I didn't ask? Does, is there anything else comes to your mind? Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate for your time.